Eight, this is breaking news. Good afternoon, I'm Liz Reyes. And I'm Meg Gatto. We begin with breaking news as a four alarm fire in the Lower Garden District spreads through four houses. Ashlyn Brothers is live at the scene on Magazine Street with the latest for you at this hour. Ashlyn. Liz and Meg, an emotional scene here this afternoon in the Lower Garden District as many people watch and wait for what's next, wondering where they'll go tonight. Seeing fire crews douse at their charred home with hose water. Several blocks are taped off as crews work to contain the fire. The smoke ha has been mostly at bay now. Uh, we're told that there are no reported injuries at this time, though there are are several residents here who appear distressed. 25 units and 72 personnel responded to the scene of this four alarm fire in the 1800 block of Hastings Place. We saw black smoke billowing from the Carondelet and St. Charles exit on our way here as the black smoke was all consuming. Consider taking into account the size of these residences and the size of this fire, uh, we're going to have uh, NOFD fire operations personnel probably on the scene through the night, checking for hot spots, making sure everything is extinguished. Uh, the last thing you want to do to have to come back out to an incident. All of our homes are close together, so anything within the city, uptown, downtown, uh, yeah, that's part of the challenge. And firefighters say the flames broke out just before 1.50. I'm told that they were on the scene within eight minutes. Many residents telling me off camera they did feel like it took a long time getting the water on the buildings to keep it at bay. We've reached back out to the fire department and we're asking if there were any water issues. Now, I did speak with one man who didn't want to go on camera but says he was in the house at the time of the fire and says his phone melted, his keys are inside, the keys to his boathouse are inside as well, so he doesn't know, but he's waiting for what's next. That's just one story of many out here this afternoon. Reporting live in New Orleans, Ashland Brothers, Fox 8, Local First.